supporting the basketball team at North, and much of my my treasures as well, but they're my sons, so we all do that. We started supporting these students because we, I received a study from DPS a while back, and it said that out of 100 Latino males that started in kindergarten, 47 of them graduated from high school. We lost half of our young men. Out of that, maybe 19 went to college. Out of that 100, only five of them received a degree in six years. That, that's not okay for our community. And so we wanted to step up and provide a leadership program. We all share the love of basketball and I took that opportunity. And so I want to introduce you to first off, Santana Angel. Um, hello, my name is Santana Angel. Um, I've been at North four years, I'm a senior this year. Um, I wanted to talk about uh, how the boys basketball program has helped me become a role model, uh, not only to my teammates, but peers at school, the kids around me. Um, it has helped me become a leader as well. I was able to attend my brother's keeper and other leadership workshops. <clears throat> um, I like to use these skills once I become a collegiate athlete. I'm gonna hand it off to my brother, Ray. Uh, I'm, I'm Ray. I've been playing basketball at North for four years. I'm a senior and I'm thankful for getting involved in this organization. Um, they've helped me through many obstacles in my life. I've had patches where I've made mistakes that I regret and they just never gave up on me. They always had my back and they kept me out of trouble. They accepted me for the things I've done and they just showed me the true meaning of family. Um, my coach requires a 2.5 GPA and Chancellor only requires a 1.9. So it motivates me to keep my grades up so that I can play. And like, I just think of that all year, like my basketball team. <coughs> would want me to have good grades, so I keep all my grades up. And that's it. <laughs> all the time, it's my friend of life. Hi, how's everyone doing? All right, so my name is Elijah Durant. I'm a senior at North High School, and I'm here to talk to you about the mentoring organization that I was brought to my first year from basketball from North High School. Um, I was just in the sixth grade, going to seventh grade, just a little black kid, just wanted to play basketball. And I came across Alfonso here, and instantly I found a connection with him. And by like him being a kid that just graduated, coming back to North High School in my summer, and just wanted to coach us and help him in the game. Uh, we just like, our relationship just kept growing and growing and growing. And when my parents divorced in eighth grade. And my dad we went through a rough time, and uh, it was like we lived in a car for about a week. Um, went from going here to this alley sleeping to going sleeping on my grandma's couch, and he uh, brought so much support to me and my family because after practice he would take me to my house off of alley from Peoria, and after every practice he would buy me food. He always made sure I had support. He always made sure I had clothes. And without him, I wouldn't dress up like this. I'll be wearing some basketball shoes, <laughs> some sandals, and some socks. And uh, he was always on me about my grades. So like, I just made the honor roll this year. And, uh, and, uh, so he just taught me about being a leader on and off the court. And without him, like all the standards and expectations I have for my younger peers, I don't know if I could keep him that high. And he always wanted me to be in my top game. Uh, he introduced me to the, my brother's keeper twice, and I sat on the panel. My eyes are closed. <laughs> and uh, I was speaking about how schools can improve on helping kids of color and Latinos feel not as target, like help us open up more in school. So that helped us out. He helped me prepare my speech. That, I didn't even know I was going to perform 30 minutes before. And uh, I just want to say without him, I could just be a troubled kid without a future ahead. And I'm going to pass it on to my team. Uh, hi, I'm, uh, I'm Zach Gonzalez, and I'm currently attending uh, Metro State University. Um, 
currently six out of eight of the seniors from the graduating class of 2018 are in college. Um, um, so for, uh, oh no. <laughs> We did a lot of community service, so like we prepared food for the homeless, and then we made like uh, gift baskets, and then we also like went to a basketball camp, and they also showed me how to like volunteer and uh, help the students up and coming for North, and then they also like helped me prepare for like new life experiences. They showed me like um, new ways to go to college and ways to get scholarships and like yeah like that. Um, group for helping support us and last but not least I'd like to thank Marlene for helping us through everything. You can see it is truly truly my my very pleasure in life and I am so lucky that I get to spend my time my talent my treasure with these guys because I love them so much and thank you YLP for supporting us and believing in our program.